What's up, wrestling fans? How you guys doing? Um, Wednesday, Brody Lee celebration. Um, we took a look at the numbers, and we wanted to uh, talk about it. The attendance numbers. Um, they uh, they had 900 paid fans with 180 comped tickets, according to the Wrestling, Ob New uh, Wrestling Observer newsletter. Crowd is reportedly the second largest uh, crowd since COVID-19 since the pandemic started, so really good numbers. Obviously, it would have been just a unbelievable amount of people showing up, you know, if it had not been, you know, the circumstances of COVID and things like that. You know, that that goes without saying with just about anybody or any anything at all. Um, But the, the ratings is what everybody really wants to talk about. Guys, the rating that AEW got the other night for the tribute to Brody Lee allegedly... I don't have the 100% stamp of 100% approval, but we are understanding the number as it comes in, and I'm going to tell you it right now as I pull it up. also want to let you guys know that I did speak about the controversy that continues about the Brody Lee situation. So hot for uh, whatever that it's not on YouTube. Uh, it's on my Patreon, Brody Lee, the cover-up controversy with Bruce Mitchell. He got fired for his article about you know, what's really going on here, and everybody really was mad at him and angry with him and stuff like that, and there was only a few people that took Bruce Mitchell's side. Did I say Brad Benjamin, Bruce Mitchell's side? And I talk about some of that here, and also some more of the controversies going on in this 16-minute uh, look into the situation. So if you want to hear about that, it's a really good little 16-minute thing with me uh, going into it and playing some clips and talking about some things right there. That's available on Patreon, even in the dollar spot, patreon.com slash Joe Cronin Show. Become a patron now, over 300 patrons uh, last month, and a lot more hopefully coming uh, this month. But it's the beginning of the month, so now's the best time to sign up right now on Patreon, guys. Please support the channel and support me through doing that. And tonight's monetize this, so that's a big deal too. Um, Tonight I'll be live at 11 p.m. Eastern time on my other channel. The numbers, according to Pro Wrestling Torch, ironically, where uh, Mitchell was fired from, 977,000 viewed. 977,000 people viewed that Brody Lee tribute show the other night. And man, dude, I how I wish they hit a million, though. I really wished that they... Imagine that man on a tribute show to him to hit a million. But even this is amazing. This is a phenomenal number, okay? Not, But, you know, ratings don't matter when it comes to, like, celebrating a guy's life. It doesn't matter what the ratings is. All that matters is, you know, celebrating the guy's life and his kids and his family getting, you know, what they got the other night. It was so beautiful, uh, but yet really sad. Like, it really was very, very sad. I actually have been sore all day today because of all the, fuck, all the breakout of the waterworks the other day. And all my sinuses ended up clogging up everywhere. And I had been feeling much better, too. And then it was like it all came back. I probably reinfected myself again. Because it was just, man, all the everything was moving in my whole face and body, bro. I didn't realize how bad, how crazy that was going to hit. And I don't remember what the sting number was. This, I mean, uh, AW uh, ratings. You know, I don't, I don't remember what it was. Let me see uh, if uh, Wrestling Inc. has it. Wrestling Inc. always does such a good job, man. Yeah, 977,000 viewers. The week before, it was uh, 775,000. So they went up, you know, um, you know, 870, 970. They went up 200, about 200,000 viewers, which is really kind of, I mean, that is very, very remarkable. And if you look at the AEW ratings... Um, let's see what the AEW ratings were with Sting. Okay, Sting was the nine was nine ninety five, I think, or something like that, or or nine hundred something. Th this looks like it's right. Yeah. And to, well, no, this is uh, is this two thousand twenty or nineteen? Below is the two thousand twenty AEW viewership tracker. Yeah. So this was. This was the Sting time where Sting showed up and they'd promoted that big show. And you can see that, according to Wrestling Inc.'s uh, numbers monitoring here, that December 9th they did a 995. Now, Winter is Coming, where Sting debuted, did a 913, 913,000. And then people knowing Sting would be there the next week and everything, 
drew in 995,000. So with all that buildup, with all that hotness, with Sting coming in and everything, 995, and last night to draw a, uh, a 977 is, is a very solid and respectable rating for a show like that is amazing. That many people were able to see uh, the tribute to Brody Lee and to uh, John Huber and, you know, for the family and, and everything else that went on there. Really, really good numbers. Really nice to see that that many people, you know, wanted to see what they did. And the record sales of the T-shirt is unbelievable. Please go buy a T-shirt if you can. It's uh, shopaw.com. You can still buy the T-shirt, obviously. It broke the record for the year. It's incredible how many people bought a T-shirt. Um, you know, so just amazing stuff. We bought T-shirts here, and um, it was it was just very nice. But yes, uh, that that that's it for me, man. What do you guys think about the ratings tonight? Is monetize this? If you guys want, go listen to my uh, kind of shocking, shocking my shocking reaction and comments to this situation as I dive deeper into it on Patreon. If you guys want to check it out, it's on my Patreon right now. And uh, Jake may be joining me in a little bit for a podcast as well, and that will be up on Patreon and, and more stuff coming. Follow me everywhere, the description box down below. Use my Amazon affiliate link if you're going to buy anything on Amazon, and I'll get credit for it. But uh, make sure you subscribe to me on Shame on News, Evil Spectrum 3. Corrupted Nation tonight is where Monetize This will emanate from. I'm Joe Cronin at JCS Commentary on Twitter. And uh, there's more uh, videos popping up now for you. Which one are you going to choose to continue watching me? You're probably naked right now watching me. I don't know. That's usually what people tell me. I'll see you guys tonight for Monetize This. Got a little bit of a uh, a big one coming tonight. Last night was amazing. Thank you for that. Me and Leah hunting treasure goblins. And uh, you guys are coming out big. But tonight, monetize this 2021. We'll see you there.